Hey there, we are back and uh, it is a beautiful summertime day here today. Lots of sunshine, temperatures warming up. It definitely feels like we're heading into the 4th of July. Just a little muggy out there too. 80 degrees in Mankato. The wind is out of the west at 17. That dew point at 65. So it is a little sticky and you can feel that moisture in the air. That's ahead of our next system and that is going to help provide moisture for rain tomorrow, tomorrow night into Friday. Currently 80 N Mankato, 80 in St. Peter, Glencoe and Hutch, Redwood Falls at 81, Fairmont, Blue Earth at 82, Algona, Esterville at 81 degrees. It is 77 in Jackson. Wyndham got you at 79. As we talked earlier, you can see a few showers and thunderstorms out in southwestern and south central South Dakota out by winter South Dakota. And that's our next system that's going to be rolling in here starting tomorrow. High pressure over us today. Cold front to our east that brought the rain yesterday, and our next system will slide in fairly quickly overnight tonight into tomorrow morning, bringing showers and thunderstorms and the potential for some locally heavy rain. Now, the good news is the severe weather threat is meh, but uh, the possibility for one to two inches of rain is definitely a thing. And as Caitlin mentioned, it's not panic time. The river levels have dropped. Things are getting better, and this isn't going to make that big of a difference, but definitely pay attention, especially if you live in a water-in-the-basement-prone type area. Make sure those sump pumps are running and ready to roll. Through today, nothing going on. Late tonight, showers and thunder showers will start to move in. Here we are at 8 o'clock this evening. Still a great evening for a fire pit or any outdoorsy holiday stuff. And then late tonight, a few showers and thunder showers overnight, and then into tomorrow morning, scattered showers and thunderstorms will continue to move through. Again, these could produce some locally heavy rain. More rain and thunderstorms late tomorrow into tomorrow night. And you can kind of see how as we head into the 4th of July evening, we will have scattered showers and thunderstorms. And so the 4th of July fireworks celebration and at 9 o'clock, again, more random scattered thunderstorms. So it will be hit and miss for your 4th of July celebration. Maybe if you wait a little while, you might be able to get it going if you do have some rain and thunderstorms. But of course, Mankato moved till Friday which is not a bad idea because things are looking a little better for Friday. We will see a few scattered showers and thunder showers earlier in the day, but by the time fireworks time rolls around, things will get better. Severe risk tomorrow. Isolated strong to severe storms. Hail and wind will be the main threat. We'll be watching. We'll let you know how things roll. Highs today in the 80s up to 83 in Mankato, 84 in Marshall. It's going to be a nice summery day. 83, sunny and warmer. West wind at 5 to 15. Tonight, 65 tomorrow. We're going to uh, see temperatures climbing into the 70s with scattered showers and thunderstorms. A few lingering thunderstorms, mainly early Friday. Then Saturday looking good with a couple of late night thunderstorms. Sunday showers and thunderstorms back again. And then it looks like we will start to dry out with an isolated shower thunderstorm or two as we take you into next week. We'll be right back. This 10-day weather forecast is brought to you by Belter Window Siding and Roofing. B-O-E-L-T-E-R. Belter is better.